This is the illegal escape route hit and run Gale Force. Let me explain how that works. You need one initiator here, Brave Roy, then follow up Gale Force such as Veloria and Thor. The plan is to have those three units attack together and then run away together. I got smite on both Bernadetta and Veloria as you can see, in case I need to engage turn 1 and disrupt the enemy's formation with Roy. And here the bonus weak Black Knight has to be killed with Veloria otherwise Black Luna is a problem. So now we can start our preparation by doing this. Finally, we are ready. We smite first, dance, and now it begins. Look, this is really sick. First, second kill, and the third one. And now you guess, we run away like this. This is really, really sick. Roy is just that good, right? And the Black Clown, I mean the Black Knight, is not going to make it. Veloria is just that good. Wow. And what if you want to gear force a defense? Of course you can and even turn 1 Hit and run is possible with Smite on Bernadetta and Veluria. Speaking of Bernadetta, she's not required. She only allows for a 3 unit hit and run. Having 2 Wings of Mercy instead allows for a turn 1 girl force. But on the other hand, Escape Route allows me to test with Thor a trap and then run away. This method is so versatile in its application, let me show you. You will also notice, oops, one peculiarity very nice with Bernadetta is inflicting damage, removing therefore some skills like catch on Sigurd, which allows me to easily one round Sigurd, otherwise this wouldn't be possible. So now we kill 3 units. Well, if we kill the 3 units, we could run away and still have smile reposition as leftover actions on Roy and Veruia, which is rather nice. Finally, let me show you a way to hit and run when the enemy just cannot counter attack. This one is my anima defense, which is rather annoying considering how many people fared against it this week, and probably much better than the weaker defenses I am seeing this week anyway. So without Bernadetta you need to double smite on a boat trap, but the method is not straightforward and a little bit more difficult to execute and more importantly now, more people use hex trap instead of boat trap. Ok I think we are ready now, to tell the truth, this scenario is not ideal for me because I am using bonus Ashera in reality, Regin is much better as you can smite and then can throw 3 spaces away which would allow me to run further away in a situation when I would have let's say a second dancer and leg yarn is dense due to moving first because of not having an assist. Notice something very useful. You can use Ardent Sacrifice at a later point to heal allies and that is really awesome. As a bonus, let me show you what you can do with Regin if I wasn't a despicable person and I wouldn't use Medeos in Anima. In this case I hit first with Regin, activate Kento, then attacking with Thor, and then doing this, reposition. This is by far the most fun, versatile method I know of. It's a lot more rewarding than your typical easy canto.